Relaxation pose, Shavasana. Breathing deep into the belly, allowing the weight of your body to sink into the mat. Taking the time with stillness in the body. Do not move the arms, do not move the palms. Do not move the feet and the toes. Soften gently the expression on your face, keeping the mouth softly open. A small gap between the upper lip and the lower lip. The eyes are softly closed like a gentle soft curtain on the ball of the eye. Relaxing the forehead. Relaxing the back of your head into the soft mat. Try to breathe a little bit deeper into the belly. Try to feel how you're pushing the diaphragm down into the space in your belly. Giving a gentle massage to your internal organ. Enjoying the feeling of your shoulder blades. Enjoying the feeling of the shoulder blades. As you feel the weight of your body presses gently against the shoulder blades. And presses the shoulder blades against the mat. Try to breathe deeply into the belly and then if you can, try to continue the breath into the chest. Filling up and pushing the belly up. And try to rise up to the chest, but keep your belly full, bringing more air and oxygen into the body. When you exhale, feel how you clean the body from all the carbon dioxide as you exhale and take everything out, making room for new fresh oxygen to come into the lungs and the blood. Feel more fresh, more alive, more aware, more relaxed. Keep softening the expression on your face. Relaxing the ball of the eye. Relaxing the eyelid. The forehead and the skull. Brain and the mind. The connection to the brain and the mind is your arms, your palms and your fingers. Allow them to fall asleep. 
So for a few moments, just breathe deeply and slowly as you feel the arms from the shoulders to the upper arm, the elbows, the forearm, the palms and the fingers. Relax. Feel the arms, the energy that flows down the arms and into the palms as they relax. And they feel heavier and heavier. Feeling the feet and the toes. Feeling the calf and the knee. Maintaining the deep and slow breathing and allowing them to relax. Thighs and buttocks, pelvis and waist. Breathe deeply, feel your back. Breathe deeply and try to feel your spine. Trying to feel the vertebras of your back. The deep inhalation, feel as if you are pushing them into the mat, into the ground. Allowing them to relax, the energy to flow through them. Relax. 
Inhale deeply and exhale. Inhale deeply and exhale. Inhale deeply and with the exhalation gently and slowly move the feet and the toes. Inhale deeply and slowly, moving the palms and the fingers. Inhale deeply and slowly, and with the exhalation, slowly close the gap between the legs. And with a deep inhalation, extend the arms to the side and over the head and deeply stretch. Inhale deeply and stretch. And with the exhalation, we slowly turn to the right side. And to the right side, we slowly come up to sitting. Sitting with cross legs. Try to feel your spine as the continuation of the relaxation as you try to feel the vertebras of your back. And as you climb with your mind from your base along your spine, like a step ladder, all the way up into the sky, as your head is rising up toward the sky. Sahanam, Vavatu, Sahanam, Vinatu, Sahavi, and Kavare, Tejasvinava, the Hitamas, to Mavidi Shavare. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Slowly holding the knees with the palm. And with the exhalation, we slowly round our back. Sinking back, stretching the arms, bringing the belly, chest, and chin in, and stretching your back and neck. With a deep inhalation, slowly pull the knees as you bring your spine in, lower back, middle back, upper back. Head up, bringing the neck in. And with the exhalation, sink back, vertebra by vertebra. Trying to roll on the sacrum. Bringing your lower back out, middle back out, upper back out, and stretch your neck by tucking the chin in. With a deep inhalation, moving forward, lower back in. Try to climb along your spine. With your awareness to the back, try to bring the shoulder blades close together as you open your chest. And with exhalation, sink back, right shoulder too high, shoulder blade in. Open the chest and pull the knees to help you. Exhalation, sinking back. Repeat this simple motion a few more times in your own pace as you try to breathe deeply, belly, chest, 
and opening up the collarbone, making room for you to breathe. And with the exhalation, empty the chest, empty the belly, closing in with the shoulders, rounding the back. Continue as you try to breathe deeper. With the inhalation, you try to bring more air into the body. And as you sink, you try to expel, exhale, and take all the air out as much as you can. Move the lower back in. Up and try to breathe deeply. And then when you go back, empty completely as you squeeze the inhalation, climb along the back, bring it in. Deep inhalation, pull yourself forward. Bring the arms to the side as you keep your chest open and the head slightly raised up. And interlock the fingers behind the back of the head. With the deep inhalation, try to push the head back against the palms. Try to push the elbows back, squeezing the shoulder blades and opening the chest as much as you can. Slowly, slowly try to lean back without falling back or losing balance. Inhale deeply, try to push the back of the head against the palms and open the elbows side and back as much as you can. Exhalation, open the mouth and release the tension. Try to breathe Slowly here, slowly. Inhale and exhale. Try to open the elbows. Good. As you maintain this position of chest and back, with the next exhalation, slowly lean toward the right side. It means you try to bring, as you keep this position of the body, you try to raise the left elbow and lower the right elbow as the head is still resting on the palms and the shoulder blades are still tucked in. With a deep inhalation back to center. Open the chest a little bit more, and with exhalation, left elbow slowly down, and right elbow slowly up as you try to keep the chest open and shoulder blades tucked in. Inhale, back, center, and up, and continue a few more times in your own pace. Exhale, slowly lower, right elbow, raise left, try to keep chest open. Inhale your back and exhale the other side as you try to focus on the shoulder blades against the back and the chest open, head resting back on the palm. Wonderful. Last time, last set, come back to center. Open the arms through the side and interlock the fingers on the lower back. Roll the shoulders back and open the chest. Inhale deeply as you look up. Exhale, move forward and down slowly, trying to raise the arm as high as you can as you try to lean forward as far as you can. Lower the head, 
and sink down. Good. Inhale, raise the head up. Lower the arms back and down. Release or unlock your fingers and place the palms on the ground behind your back. Fingers pointing backwards. Inhale deeply, belly, chest, raise the head up and try to take it far back. And then raise the buttocks as you press against the palms. Raise the buttocks up as you reach to the other direction, reaching out with the knees toward the mat. Raise the buttocks up. Roll the shoulders back, shoulder blades in as you try to open the chest and squeeze your mid-upper back inside. Try not to tilt to any side. Lift high and push the knees into the ground. Wonderful. Exhalation, we slowly, slowly go down. Bring the palms to the knees, back of the palms to the knees. Open the mouth. Ah, softly close the eyes and relax. Feel the body. Give yourself a few moments. Try to breathe slowly. Good. So, with inhalation, with exhalation, we bring the palms together in front of the chest in Namaste. Interlock the fingers. Interlock the fingers. And with inhalation, push the palms forward and out, away from the body. Continue to inhale or take another inhalation as you raise the arms up toward the sky. As the palms are facing the ceiling, the back of your palms facing your head. Stretch up toward the sky. Good. Exhalation. Bend the elbows and interlock the fingers on the back of the head. Inhale, lean back as far as you can. Open the chest. Exhale, try to keep the chest open as you close the elbows and bring the chin into the hole in the throat. Deep into your throat, but try to keep the chest open. Pull the chin inside, chin inside. Inside, you feel a deep stretch in the neck, upper back. A deep inhalation, open up again, the elbows, raise the head, push the back of the head against the palms and open the arms slowly through the side and interlock the fingers on the lower back. Inhale, roll the shoulders back as you stretch the arms and open the chest. Raise the head up and move far forward and down. Raise the arms as high as you can, leaning far forward and down, dropping the head in the end of the movement. Good. Inhale, raise the head up. Come all the way up, release the palms and place them behind your back, fingers pointing backwards. Exhale, inhale, look up slowly, take the head up and back as you raise the buttocks off the mat, press into the palms and push the knees into the mat. As you raise the buttocks high, low back in, middle back in, upper back in, try to push strongly into the palms and bring your back inside. Good. Exhalation. We slowly, slowly go down and bring the back of your palms to your knees. Open the mouth and give yourself a few moments to feel. Keep the mouth softly open and relax. Allow the chest to breathe. Very nice. Slowly we are moving to table stands. Add and buttocks up. Add and buttocks in. OK. 
คิดเขาอินเดอะเทเบิลสแตนส์ไอคุอาวอร์กิ้งเรซันต์ลีทรายทูเมคชูดิทูอาร์นัตโอนลีบริงิงเดอะโลแบกอินบัตยูบริงอัลโซเดมิลแบกอินเดอะอัพเปอร์แบกอินเดอะชัลด์เบลด์ยูดิดเวลีนัสแอนด์เดนยูพุชเดมอัพเปอร์อินรันด์แบก Good. Now inhale, blow back. Yeah, now it's perfect. Don't continue the motion. Just keep them there. And exhale. See the angle of the knees should be 90 degrees with the mat. Shoulder blades are too far. Bring them close together. Feel how it helps you to squeeze your back in. Shoulder blades, inhale back in. Try to keep the shoulders away from the heels. Good. Next inhalation. Extend the right leg back and place the ball of the foot or the toes on the ground as far as you can back. Legs straight out. Good. Inhale. Open the left arm far to the left side, and up as you try to bring your left fingers up to the sky, trying to align the arms right and left as you push the right arm strongly into the mat and you lift the body up. Try to open the chest. Looking up through your left fingers, or if it strains your neck, look down to the right fingers. Inhale deep and exhale as you're activating strongly the right arm, pushing strongly into the mat. Soften the expression on your face. Keep the mouth softly open, or if you can, smile. Smile is a very good way to release tension. Gentle smile, not a salesperson one. Salesperson smile doesn't work. It's the same tension. Good. This is a more natural smile. Keep breathing and reaching. Wonderful. Yeah, you know this stretch in the face. People call smile. No, this is not a smile. Good. Slowly bring the left arm far to the left side and down. And with the next inhalation, raise the right leg up to the sky as you look up. All the way up. Try not to raise the right hip. Yes. Try to keep the right hip down as you align with the left hip. Parallel to the ground as you raise the right leg high. Good. Wonderful. Slowly bring the right leg back down, far away from the body, toes on the ground. Exhale all the air out. Press strongly into the left arm as you reach with the right arm far to the right side, shifting the weight to the left. And you raise the right arm to the side and up. Good. Stretch out and push the left arm strongly. Reach through the right fingers. And if you didn't smile in the twist before, it's a good time to smile now. Ah, see, it's worked better. 
Breathe deeply, wonderful. Reach through and breathe. Try to feel how you're opening the upper back, stretching, push, lift up. Inhale and exhale. Wonderful. Use more the right leg. If you lose balance, you can bring the right heel down to the ground on your left side. You can, lower the, you can finish lowering the right heel down and then you'll be more balanced. Breathe deep and slow. Don't blink so much. Don't show any stress signs because they will create stress. Very nice. Slowly we bring the right arm far to the right side. And then as we come back, we bring the right knee down. Round the back a few times. Get cow, head and buttocks in, head and buttocks up as you breathe. Feel the difference between the sides. Wonderful. Next deep inhalation, head and buttocks up, we send the left leg back straight, bringing the toes back as far as you can with your left leg straight. Wonderful. A deep inhalation, we press into the left palm and again we raise to the right side and up. Reach far away from the body and then up. Trying to open the joints, shoulders, stretching out the shoulder blade before you squeeze them into your back. Reach far, push. Don't shift the weight too far back. Try to keep the weight more or less even between the left palm, the right knee. The left leg is a kind of support. Reach through. Don't look so miserable. It's very difficult to watch. Thank you. Breathe deep. Oh, this is better. Wonderful. Reach through. Breathe deep, reaching through. Good. Reach through, reach up. Wonderful. Inhale and exhale. Try to feel the left shoulder blade as you try gently to press it against your back. Inhale deeply. And with the exhalation, far to the right side, bring the right arm down. And with the next deep inhalation, send the left leg up. Try to keep the left hip in the same place as it was before. Parallel to the right hip. Parallel to the ground, aligned with the right hip. Inhale deep and exhale. Very nice. Inhale deep and exhale. Yes, but try not to... Keep the weight. No, no, raise the leg up. Raise the leg. What happened? Yeah, I don't want you to kind of twist exactly. Lift up and breathe. Use the arms more. Use the right arm more. That's it. Good. Bring the left leg down. Toes to the ground. And extend the left arm far to the left side and up. If you feel it's difficult to balance, you can lower your left heel down to the right side gently. Okay? Good. Wonderful. Reach, push through the right arm. Inhale and exhale. Try to reach through. Try to open up your chest, your back. Breathe. Breathe deep and slow. 
it's difficult to breathe deep, breathe slow. Don't strain your neck. Very nice. Slowly, slowly bring the left arm far to the left side. Bring the left knee in. Table stands. Head and buttocks up, head and buttocks in. Wonderful. Inhale, head and buttocks up, toes in. Exhale, down dog. <laughs> Inhale, bring the right foot forward between the palms. And exhale, bring the left foot forward, joining it with the right leg. Bring the chin to the chest, try to direct the forehead to the shin. Slowly, slowly extend the arms over the head as you bend the knees. And try to come up with a straight back as possible, arms extension to the shoulders. Reaching out and come up with a straight back. Try to tuck the tailbone between the legs as you move the lower back in, middle back in, upper back in as you bend backwards. Tuck the tailbone, squeeze. Try to contract your back as you bend backwards. Tight and go back. Tight here actively. Wonderful. Palms together in front of the chest in Namaste. Restart a few rounds of the sun salutation. Before we start, keep the palms together in front of the chest. Open the mouth, close the eyes, and bring the legs close together. Try to soften the expression on your face. Try to remember to keep the mouth softly open. You'll feel your chest more free to move. Movement number two, with inhalation, we lower the arms down and lift them up to the sky. Tuck the tailbone in, lower back in, middle back in, upper back in, as you go far back, but in an even way. You don't break the lower back. Wonderful. Try to focus on middle back inside. Good. Shift the weight back to the heels as you push the buttocks back and go down with a straight back and the arms as far as you can forward and down. Bring the palms to the sides of your feet, fingers and toes aligned. If you need to, bend the knees. Bring the chin to the chest and the forehead toward the shin. With inhalation, bend the knees and send the right leg big step back. Place the knee down, take the toes out, sink in and look up. Try to tie the right buttock, opening the right hip flexor, sinking in. Good, bring the right toes in. Straight the right leg to lunge. Join the left leg to the right to plank. Push-up position. Bend the knees slowly and even slower than that, bring the chest to the ground to Ashtanga Namaskar. Eight points on the ground. Chin, chest. Palms, knees and the ball of the foot. With inhalation, slowly slide forward, pressing the groin area into the ground, 
raise the head up and we come to Bhujangasan, but try to feel how you bring the neck in as you raise the head, chin stretching out. Then the upper back in, then the middle back in, and eventually slightly the lower back as you want to feel a natural curve, and a natural squeezing of your back in in an even way. You shouldn't feel any pressure in one part more than the other, so especially not of the low back, right shoulder back. Push into the ground and bring the toes in as you go to down dog. Keep pushing the ground as you lift the tailbone and stretch the arms. Keep pushing the ground. Wonderful. A deep inhalation, the right foot forward between the palms. Big step. Lining the toes with your fingers, left knee down, toes out, sink in, tie the left buttock, stretch. You can feel the left hip flexor opening up. Good. Collect the left leg to the right, straightening the legs. Legs together, palms at the side of your legs, fingers aligned with the toes, chin to the chest, forehead to the knees, or shin, as we are in the same posture as we were in posture number three, is posture number ten. Inhale, you can bend the knees a little bit as first you stretch the arms far over the head, aligning your back. Stretching your back and coming up. Straight back. Stretch your arms, tuck the tailbone and go all the way. Curve your back, tuck tailbone in between your legs as you open your chest. Wonderful. And slowly palms together in front of the chest. In Namaste. Very nice. Two with inhalation, lower the arms, tuck the tailbone in, tie the buttocks, push in the lower back, the middle back, the upper back. As you go far back, tailbone all the way in and open the chest, open the solar plexus, go far back. Good. Shift the weight back, pushing the buttocks back, reaching far forward with the arms, going down and in. Remember the palms, the fingers, and forehead to shin. Bend the knees, sending the left leg. Big step back, knee down, toes out, sink in, look up, inhale. Bring the left toes in, straight your left leg to lunge, join the right, and with a long exhalation, knees down and chest down. Seven. Cobra, inhale, up. Exhale, toes in, stretch your arms down, dog. Inhale, left leg, big step forward between the palms, sink in with the right knee, right toes out, look up and open. Legs together, that means right leg forward, and chin to the chest, forehead to the shin. Bend the knees a little bit, stretch the arms far over the head, far away from the body as you come up with straight back, good. Wonderful. Tuck tailbone in, lower back in, middle back in. Tight your back, squeeze and open the front. Back bend is a strong front stretch. And palms together in front of the chest as you exhale. Open the mouth. We do another round. Two inhale. Arms forward, up, bend far back. Re exhale, move far forward and down. 
Forehead to shin. Four inhale, right leg, big step back, knee down, toes out, sink in and look up. Five legs together in the plank, push up position. Six knees, chest. Seven inhale into the cobra, feel your spine moving in. Eight toes in, down dog. Nine, right leg, big step forward, knee down, toes out. Ten, left forward, chin, forehead. Inhale, reach arms far over the head and come up with a straight back. Reach through fingers, tuck tailbone, deep in and open chest, lift and open stretch, solar plexus. Exhale, palms together in front of the chest. And two, inhale. Three, exhale, far forward and down, straight back. Four, left back, inhale, knees down, toes out. Five, legs together. Six, knees down, chest down, long exhalation, inhale, seven. Bhujangasan, Cobra, A, Down Dog, Push, Toes In, Nine, Left, Forward, Knee Down, Toes Out, Ten, Legs Together, Forehead to the Knees, Eleven, Stretch the Arms Far, Come Up, Bend Far Back, and 12 palms together, spread the arms and legs, open the mouth, close the eyes and feel. Palm facing forward, anatomy pose, open the armpit a little bit as if you have a small tennis or golf ball under the armpit, allowing your chest, your ribcage to breathe and the energy to flow. Lean back with the head a little bit, tuck the chin in a little bit, and space. Relax the tailbone, bend the knees slightly, and relax the tailbone in. Good. Very nice. Keep the mouth softly open and listen to the heartbeat. Listen to the heartbeat. Feel your lungs. Very nice. Keep the mouth softly open, the eyes softly closed. Inhale, deeply open the arms through the side and a little bit behind the line of the body as you raise the arms up, behind the line of the body. Try to press the palms together, behind your head if you can. Reach up to the sky as you try gently to lift your shoulders and shoulder blades and open your back. Keep the tailbone tucked in and lift the middle back, upper back, all the way up to the sky. Inhale deep and exhale, tailbone tucked in. Tuck the tailbone and reach up together, reach up. Good. Slowly, slowly start bending the knees and sitting back. As if there is a chill right behind you as you keep your arms stretching up to the sky. You bend the knees and you sit on the chair behind you. Reach far with the arms. Wonderful. Open the arms through the side. Don't change anything in your body.
interlock the fingers on the low back. Inhale deeply, roll the shoulders back and look up to the sky, pushing the chest forward and try to sit deeper into the chair.
Breathe deep and slow. Trying to reach with the toes all the way up to the sky. What? Well, so pinch, let's put your mat. No pinching allowed. Slowly, slowly bend the knees down. Bend the knees and bring them to the forehead. Bring the palms down to the ground. And go down vertebra by vertebra. Bring the feet to the ground and raise the buttocks. Wonderful. Slowly, slowly sink down vertebra by vertebra. Bend the knees to the chest and pull yourself up to sitting. Feet on the ground. Good. Hold behind your thighs and open the chest. Lower back in, middle back in, upper back in. I want you for a few moments to feel the chest lifted up. Feel the chest rising, pressing the spine in. Press the spine in. Holding behind your thighs and pull. Squeeze the shoulder blades in. Wonderful. Release the grip of the palms behind the thighs. And slowly sit on the palms, on the back of the palms. Lean on the back of the palms. Try to bring the arms behind your body and then sit on the back of the palms. Keeping the feet on the ground and slowly leaning back on the elbows. Lift the chest up and take the head back. Wonderful. Inhale deeply as you lift the chest higher and disconnect the feet, a fracture of an inch off the ground. Inhale deep and exhale. Try to breathe slowly. This, mid back, try to bring it in. Feel the tension in here. So, and try to close it with the shoulder blades. Yes. I know. And raise the feet. Good. Exactly. This area. Exactly. This area and this area are the same. Right? Feel it. Back and front. Wonderful. Exactly. See how you close? That's it. And breathe into it. Keep the mouth open. Breathe deeply. Try to discover the center of your chest. The point of the center of your chest on your back and squeeze it in. If you discover the center of your chest on the mat, you'll be able to push it in. Push it in. This point is on the back and chest is same point. So now try to squeeze it in. See the difference? Good. Push it in. Wonderful. Breathe and bring it in. Wonderful. This is nice. Inhale, raise the head up. And exhale, go back. Spread the arms and legs wide and open the mouth. 
Keep the mouth softly open. Breathe. Feel the weight of your body, especially the amazing sensation of the mid upper back on the mat. Real deep amazing sensations. Keep the mouth softly open. Deeply and exhale. Inhale deeply and exhale. Inhale deeply and with the exhalation we slowly, slowly close the gap between the legs. The deep inhalation, extend the arms over the head and deeply stretch from toes to fingers. Inhale, raise the arms up toward the ceiling. And with the exhalation, you raise the head and you point with your arms, your fingers toward your toes as you come up very slowly to sitting with straight back and legs. Keep reaching forward with the arms, arms parallel to the ground and palm facing each other. Open the mouth and open the chest. If you need to, you can bend the knees a little bit, but try to open the chest as much as you can, you need to open the chest much more. Bend the knees a little bit, then try to move your lower back in, middle back in, and open the chest. Good. Slowly, slowly, we go to sleep. So we slightly, slightly, with a straight back, starting to sink back. Straight back, don't allow the belly to sink in, don't allow the chest to sink in. Keep your fingers reaching far, and when you feel it's working, you stop. You round it, so stop before you round your belly or chest. Don't round the back, don't bring the belly in, keep the chest up, bend the knees a little bit. Lift the chest higher, good. Keep reaching out, wonderful. Let's say from here we are going to bend the knees a little bit more to disconnect the feet from the ground, the legs from the ground. The variation of Navasana, the boat. Before you were a chair, now you are a boat. So be a nice boat. Breathe deeply and slowly. Wonderful. Keep the chin slightly in, don't break the back of your neck. Reach far through the fingers. Try to raise the legs a little bit higher. Keep breathing deeply into the belly. Deep as you reach far through the fingers. Five, yes, this exactly, this is the lower part of the belly, which needs to be a little bit stronger. Four, three, why not? Yes, yes. Two. And one. Wonderful. 
sink back slowly, spread the arms to the side, keep the knees bent, feet to the ground, legs together, and lower the knees to the left. Wonderful, very nice. Twist far to the left, tuck the tailbone in, tie the buttocks. Low back in, middle back in, upper back in, open chest in this twist. Inhale, bring the knees back up. And exhale, slowly take them down to the right. Again, try to tie the buttocks. As you bring your back all the way in. Open the groin area, open belly, open chest, reach to the left arm, look to the left, breathe deep, tight buttocks, open the groin area, and reach through, very good, very nice, inhale, back to center, and spread the legs wide, low back into the ground, open the mouth, tuck the chin in, and relax. Keep the mouth softly open, the eyes softly closed, and relax. Allow yourself to relax. After this intense practice, you don't need to do anything. You don't need to go anywhere. You can relax and rest. Aware. Relax.
Inhale deeply and exhale. Inhale deeply and exhale. Exhalation gently and slowly of the feet and the toes. Inhale deeply and with the exhalation of the palms and the fingers. Inhale deeply and with the exhalation slowly, slowly. Close the gap between the legs. With a deep inhalation, extend the arms over the head and deeply stretch, like after a good night's sleep. With the exhalation, slowly turn to the right side. With the inhalation, come up to sitting with cross legs. Line the spine. Relax. I'd like to thank teachers with the yoga from the east to the west. Thank you very much. A beautiful and peaceful day. Hari Om Tat Sat. Namaste.